Should the sheriff police be extinct? This is the year 2022. Today is uh, July the 13th. And me as IMP, your dirge drummer priest, here today to denounce Nazi policing against black people on American soil. In the wake of the George Floyd execution, many cities uh, across America defunded the police. George Floyd was killed on May 25th, 2020. This is now two years later, and now we see that defunding is fake. Um, in fact, if the average citizen was to do a little research, we will find that uh, the idea of defunding was probably put forth by the police themselves. At issue here is what can we really do to make the police system democratic so that they actually fit into the democracy instead of sticking out like they do. Our goal as black people must be to put an end to black slave rule. Uh, Put an end to the institution of slavery. We are now dealing with uh, Nazi policing. Uh, And over 50 million people perished in World War II in a vain attempt to exterminate the Nazis and their evil methodologies. But here black people are today uh, facing the exact same evil Nazi cops that our ancestors were supposed to have gotten rid of. (laughs) It's 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 like a roach infestation, they're back again. Defunding the Nazi police is not going to help Taisha Miller, Breonna Taylor, Bhatan Shin John, or Okasa Johnson. Because all these so called social programs included in the Los Angeles Sheriff's Department eleven million eleven billion dollar budget are administered by the same Nazi police who have publicly come out admitting that they don't like black people like Alex uh, Villanueva did. And by the way, we we don't like you either. Um, We have to find, (coughs) we have to find a solution that is going to specifically address racial profiling. And the only solution is to allocate 25% of the police budget to the defense fund so black people can actually defend themselves in court systems against Nazi policing. Because they can be sued, by the way. I don't know what who has told you a lie that said they cannot be sued. They can be sued. Uh, black people do not have access to the legal system at all. Since 1865 to now, there are no pro bono attorneys. Uh, that's, a, that's a, also a damn lie. Um, black people only have access to two types of attorneys. Criminal attorneys, when they are condemned or criminalized as criminals, or corpse chasers, when they're publicly executed by Nazi police. That's it. <clears throat> Combating racial profiling in the courts is one of the keys to eliminating the systematic genocide that currently that's currently in place. Black people cannot wait for white people to help them. These people um, include the media that make billions of dollars a day watching these Nazi cops execute black people on TV. We have gone from being slaves to being the criminally enslaved, the number one criminally enslaved race in the United States. 
from 1865 to 2022. We've been the number one criminally enslaved race this year, last year, the year before, all the way back to 1865. Not a damn thing has changed. There is no easy way to freedom. But uh, if you want to get a Nazi off your back, then you are going to have to learn how to defend yourself in court and how to fight them to win. Uh, Thanks. That's all for today. Leave your comments below.